New at 10 after mounting pressure, the Elmhurst Community School Board is addressing a disturbing video of a student with disabilities being bullied. CBS 2's Maribel Gonzalez is outside York Community High School, where they say the boy's parents do not want to press charges. Maribel? Yeah, that's right. I spoke to the family right after the school board meeting, and they say they're not happy with what happened to their loved one, that student with special needs that appears in that video, because in a sense, they feel he was manipulated into the situation. Given his disability, they tell me they feel as though he was just trying to fit in. Bullying or violence of any kind will not be tolerated in Elmhurst District 205. Deeply disturbed and heartbroken is how the Elmhurst District 205 School Board describes this video taken last week, which appears to show a group of students shoving a boy with a disability inside of a school bathroom at York Community High School, all while laughing and taunting him. The board announcing Tuesday night no criminal charges will be filed in the case following an investigation by the Elmhurst Police Department. According to police, the student with special needs, including several of the teens shown in the video, are on the school's wrestling team, and they willfully engaged in the behavior seen here. Both the parents of the student and school administration have decided that this matter would be handled through the school disciplinary process. The school board saying the students involved will be facing significant consequences, although they wouldn't specify what that entails. Confidentiality laws prohibit identification of the students involved and specific disciplinary actions completed. But the response from the school falls short for some parents. It definitely looked like hazing and a bunch of kids taking advantage of somebody who's vulnerable and doesn't understand what's going on and how he's being treated. Now, the family of the student with special needs tells me that even though they chose not to press criminal charges, they do appreciate the school taking disciplinary action against the students involved. Reporting live outside of York Community High School, Maribel Gonzalez, CBS2 News. Maribel, thank you.